parts N5 and N6 go on the outside of the ship. Note on N6 there are actually five holes. I only use four, the ones that are evenly spaced, and is used to create the climbing ladders that you see here. N1 is actually here at the front. This part right here. And I've used that to stabilize the two masts. You can see N4 is on the inside and it's very close to the, uh, the back mast it's going to be used to secure lines to both masts. So here is N4 and I'm going to place those somewhere in this area here because I'm going to have some go straight up to these, this mast and the others will extend out to the front mast area. Before I attach these uh, supports for the rigging lines I found that it's easier to go ahead and pre-thread them, just leave uh, extra thread so you have plenty to work with. And then after you have them threaded, to attach them to the inside near the rail and behind each of the masts. So I've got it, uh, those are all threaded now. And I've got most of them installed, I was just using this as an example. And I did put a drop or two of super glow on the, the rope supports and I'll hold it in that position just for a couple seconds. Then I did let it dry before I really start pulling on those lines. Once that's set, then I'm going to move the lines aside and start putting some of the buildings and the other items that I made. I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, glue them on the ship. So the instructions cover this pretty well and there are little lines on the deck of the ship showing where each of the items goes. So I uh, work feverishly to get this part done and I do that because it is very difficult to get in there once you want all the, run all these rope lines. Now that I have most of the items that go on the deck in place, now I, there's more that I'll add and there are things that I've made by hand. I'll show you that later. But now I can start stringing these uh, lines up to where the sails and masts are. Okay, when I do the, the line work on the masts and things, I don't do any specific knotting. I use super glue. So I just loop it around a couple times. But to start with, I'll just do one. And then I hold the string kind of tight. Just a dot of super glue. And then I'll take and I'll wrap this around there one more time. Now I'll just pull it tight and hold it for a few seconds. Again, this time I'm doing all the inside ones first. So here I'm going to go to the outside of this. This is where I pull the string behind. And I can move this right out to the edge. Loop it around one more time, hold it in place. A little drop of super glue on here. And then I'll loop this around one more time. Hold it in place just for a few seconds. And then I'll do the same thing all the way up each mast on the out or each uh, sail support on the outside. So eventually I will do the proper knotting on things like this and positioning and things. But this is, again, this is just entry level. This is just to uh, have the, the rope work done for effect. And uh, I'm enjoying it and I'll continue to educate myself on model shipbuilding, but this is a good start.